hello it's Sarah and I went to Hobby Lobby today I I was up very early and I just decided I, it would be nice to take a ride it snowed here on Saturday and it we still have half a snowman on my yard but he's almost gone anyway it was such a nice day um, so I took a ride end up spending 50 bucks which I didn't need to do and I went for votives these were $2.99 and they're not quite as big as the one that I used for this fairy house and I think I got this at Michael's um, <laughs> and I didn't need to go all the way to Hobby Lobby it's a little bit of a drive um, to get anything but I mean they're different they're a little smaller um, I got these which $5.99 for one, two, three, four, five, six of the um, the little uh, electric tea lights. I guess they're electric. Um, <laughs> they were supposedly 50% off, but because it's a value pack, it's not 50% off. So I got it. Don't you know, I go to the dollar store on the way home, past the dollar store. Here's a three pack for a dollar. And I was debating when she said, yeah, they're not on sale. Because it would have been $3. So I was like, that's worth it, you know. But I got them. And you know what? It's all right. Because I'm planning on, I think I'm going to sell a couple of these on my eBay store, or my Etsy store. Um, I actually got these votives. So this is the one that was $2.99. This is a dollar. So it's quite a bit smaller this would be the comparable I guess it would hold the same amount kind of sort of you know I like that it's tall and because you can fit more stuff going up so maybe I'll only put two windows on it but I'm gonna try them anyway I got four of those from the dollar store so I'm excited about them I am I'm gonna play around with some more fairy houses I actually made another one Hey Matt. Hey. I'm making a video. So I made this one yesterday. And I think I spoiled it by patinaing. It was so I used the red glitter clay on the shutters, the red uh, the blue glitter clay on the curtains. I had a light blue glitter clay. Just I don't know. It that black paint just gets in every nook and cranny because the leaves just look so clear. I have a picture, like a before and after. Um, I'll post it on my Facebook page. But, I mean, I don't hate it. It's just that sometimes when you dull down the colors, and then I put silver rub and buff on my bricks, and it just came up too silver. I'm going to do it with, I'm going to keep the clay uh, natural, and maybe just add some mica powders or I mean um, yeah, either mica powders or the mica um, rubs but um, you know they're very similar uh, anyway I think also Gail is Gail I think it's Thompson Gail um, one of my subscribers suggested she was going to use either a dark green or a brown to patina and I had actually thought of that myself and meant to do it and then I just grabbed the black paint like I went into autopilot so I'm definitely going to try that on a couple of these I have six here um, that I could play with so um, I got these on sale this was all 50% off I really try not to buy anything these are unless it's on sale 12 millimeter and these are actually bead caps but I think I want to do a flower or a um, garden themed picture frame so I'm going to be making some tiles with a garden theme and I think this is super cute like just to have a small tile with that and then this this was um, $5.99 but 50% off so $3 and I got a bunch of bling butterflies so these are these are going to be embedded in the clay to make tiles. I just think they're super pretty. So, but for three dollars, that's a lot. So I did that. But guys, this was one of the best things. Look what I found. 
277 for a block of clay. It's not on sale. I mean, it's better to get it when it's on sale. But they had the Primo Accents. And this is called Yellow Gold Glitter, which I've never seen. I've seen like the metallic, the pearls. Maybe they're pearls, but this is Yellow Gold Glitter. I got two packs of that. White Gold Glitter. This is called, yeah, White Gold Glitter. Look at that. It's like silver glitter. Oh, it's so pretty in person. It's incredible. And opal. So I don't know if this is actually translucent clay with like opalescent glitter flakes in there, but I can't wait to try that. I'm so excited. I don't know. I may just make tiles, like filler tiles with this, just plain filler tiles. We'll see what happens, you know? So I had to get that. I went, you know, I am on clay right now. So this is my jewelry. And so I've just been, like I have these flowers. These were are from the $1.50 bin at Michael's. Um, I have these butterflies from, I don't know when I got them, but I've just been kind of tucking away little flower things in here. I have a dragonfly. I think he's too big. I may have to put him on a fairy house. So I'll put them in there and use them for my garden themed one. This, all of the um, paper studio stuff was 50% off and I just thought these little, um, they're handles and they have um, screws and everything but I thought maybe I could put something like that on a fairy house too and hang stuff off of it. I don't know. They, I just felt like I needed to have them. I didn't have anything like that in my stash because I'm really not buying um, that much. I'm trying not to buy. I mean, there was a lot of new, speaking of which, this stamp set, which I am so excited to play with today. I will be probably coming back after this and make a video. I'm going to stamp on white clay with these stamps and I'm pretty sure this is ATC size so two and a half by three and a half oh yeah they're a little bit big but still I mean so without the trim it's two and a half by three and a half so excited I think the two and a, yeah I'm, I'm so excited because I'm gonna color these in with mica powders Maybe I should try the pearl. No, no, no. I got to do white. Um, but anyway, so this is by Hampton Arts. And there were like three different ones of these. Three or four different ones. Very similar. The clear stamps with the kind of like the Zentangled or, you know, designs on them. So, uh, but I, they're 10 bucks. I use the coupon. And I'm not trying to buy other stuff. I just, I really, I really try because I wanted to get wind chimes and like a bunch of other stuff and I did not get it um, so all right I'm gonna go away gather up some supplies and I am going to come back and probably do an ATC with this stamp set I got all right you guys thanks for watching